killing mobs is really fun. But it's even more fun to collect their loot. So today, let's discuss the top 10 rarest mob drops that you can get in Minecraft. Total side note, look at this village. There's a guardian temple right there. Well, if you want the seed, here you go. At number one, let's talk about foxes. As you can see with this guy, hey, come back. As you can see with this guy here, sometimes foxes have stuff in their mouth. And on rare occasion, a fox can actually spawn with an emerald in his mouth. Is this true? Can I see it? Oh, what's that guy have? What are you guys holding? I guess I can hold a ton of different stuff. But yeah, emerald has an 8.5% chance of spawning in his mouth. So yeah, if you're down bad for some emeralds, kill some foxes. My computer can't handle all these foxes. Anyways, carrying on. Let's talk about music discs. Skeletons and creepers can unite in a beautiful, beautiful marriage to give you a musical jam. Here's how it works. He needs to shoot him. If he dies, he drops a disc. Let's try this out. All right, uh, shoot him, shoot him. Uh, it didn't work. But if you're smart, you could trap them. The plan is foolproof. Put a skeleton in here, put a creeper in here, and give me a... Let's just cut that part out. Most of my viewers are not subscribed. So if you like this video, please change that. Let's try it again, Mr. Skeleton. Keep doing that over and over. And there you have it. Mr. Dude is dead and he drops me a music disc randomly. I got Ward. Let's play it. That's a banger. How could you hate a panda bear? They're so cute and adorable. And this one looks kind of angry. But if you didn't know, pandas can spawn with different kinds of emotions. There's angry pandas, there's old pandas, there's all these weird kind of pandas. And one of them is called a weak panda. What does he look like? I don't know. Let's try this command. Oh, he has snot in his nose. That's nasty. I actually feel terrible for this guy. I'm so sorry, man. Not. <laughs> Back to the video and being appropriate. If you can find a baby weak panda, so this in a baby form, they have a 1 in 700 chance of dropping a slime ball, which I guess is supposed to be their snot. Nice. Oh, how I love commands. Baby, we- That's not the right command. Why are you- Get up. What? Take my word for it, they drop slime balls. Just to clarify, you don't have to kill the baby panda, he'll just like drop it as if he just sneezed all over himself. Next up, the very scary and dangerous mob of the charged creeper. A charged creeper can aid you in getting mob skulls. Like zombie heads, skeleton heads, and creeper heads, all thanks to this guy right here. Whoopsies. Oh, whoop. My bad. Oh, that was an accident. Oh, oh, he's an MLG pro! He did the vine play! You're sick! But anyways, put on some armor like I will, get another mob near this guy, and very simply, make the charge creeper- <gasps> I might die. Make him blow up and kill the zombie. Quick! Oh, I survived. Where's the head? There it is! Look at the head! Hey, that's awesome! Bada bing, bada boom. But yeah, pretty well known tactic, but if you want to behead your mob friends, by all means, go for it. Who doesn't love a nice old bunny? They're cute, they're adorable, they're fluffy, but they drop a really cool piece of loot. Come here, you little runt. These guys have a 10% chance of dropping a lucky rabbit's foot. But like most things on this list, using a looting sword, we can get it quicker. So give me it. Oh, first try, look at that. And what is this thing good for? Not much. I think I can make a potion with it, right? Potion of leaping, I think that's how you make it, right? Woo. Kind of fun. Trash. Worthless. No one wants it. I'm just kidding, Mojang. I love you. If you can find a pillager outpost, pillagers can actually drop a very useful item for you. That being an enchanted book. A random enchantment of any kind in a book form. So, pillagers, give me a book. I will love you forever. Well, according to the wiki, there's only a 5% chance of them dropping it, so it might take you a while to find, but that's a really good deal. You get a free enchanted book for just killing a strange gray man. I'm down with that. I'm gonna exploit you. By the way, this loot drop also applies to vindicators. It's time to take to the oceans because next up, we're talking about drown. Hello, dolphin buddy. If you're like most people, we kill drown to get their tridents. Duh, tridents are awesome. But they also have a 5 to 11% chance of dropping a copper ingot. I'm also drowning. I'm going to literally die. And additionally, these guys can also drop a nautilus shell, which you can use to make a conduit. A conduit is an underwater beacon. Whoopsie. So yeah, murder some drowned. You'll be thankful. This video is getting dark really fast. Now this one I thought was fake, but it actually is real. Zombies, skeletons, piglins, husk, and stray can all spawn with a pumpkin on their head. And for the rate of spawnage, I literally have no idea. I searched the wiki, couldn't find anything about a number, so yeah, I used commands to get this guy, but they do spawn naturally, apparently. Don't hold me to that. But yeah, if you want some free pumpkins from your undead friends, you could get it if you kill them. 
Now for the last two, we're talking about witches and wandering traders. They love to throw potions at you. you. What? You are an idiot. But you can see, they can sometimes be holding a potion to drink it. If you kill them when they're drinking it, you can get the potion. So give me that. Come on. Give me that. Give me that. G give me that. There we go. I, he didn't drop it. The point I'm trying to make is if you are lucky and you're killing a witch or a wandering trader at the right time, you can get their beverage. What says you, wandering trader? Oh, you're dr Oh, give me that. 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 I lost him. I promise it works. So yeah, guys, those are the rarest mob loots in Minecraft that you can get without cheats or hacks. If you enjoyed this video, make sure to subscribe and hit the bell if you want to see more like this. And most importantly, burn your friendly villager neighbors. So much for watching. Make sure to like, subscribe, do all that good stuff. And I'll talk to you guys next time. So until then, goodbye.